So now that we've gone through the main types of drawings that we want to include to represent our project, um, we have one more drawing to do, but you, ha you really have a choice. Um, it could be an interior elevation, it could be a perspective, it could be another elevation if you choose. Um, in this case, I decided that uh, I'd like to show an interior elevation since this is kind of an unusual house. And we do have this taller part of the house for that great room. And then there's the lower part with the bedroom. So I can really emphasize that idea. In general, I would say don't worry about uh, light lines or dark lines. I think dark lines are always going to graphically come across the best. So feel free to do that and have your eraser handy like this if you decide, oh, that didn't come out quite the way you had in mind. Anyway, an interior elevation is where you cut the build, if, if the building is sitting like this on the ground, it's like you cut through and then you're looking inside what it looks like inside the building. So we're showing the inside of the space. Um, here's a window more in the distance. So I'm gonna give that a lighter line than the things that I'm cutting through. So things that we see in the distance, we wanna see those lighter. That's glass, this is glass. This might be a good indication of, of glass as opposed to solid walls that are otherwise what you might be showing. The idea here is to use your creativity. So feel free to use things that you haven't necessarily seen. This is your chance to do something different and something that you like. Now, doing an interior elevation isn't necessarily going to be the best additional drawing for every kind of project, so I'll show you a couple of other examples. Um, a perspective is another one of the options for the type of drawing that you could do. Obviously, this is a different project, but just the idea of what does the house look like, maybe, maybe as you come up the driveway, more of a 3D type of drawing. And don't worry if it isn't perfect, but it's more, it's kind of your idea of what that could look like. Here's an example of cutting a section through the site where there's a water feature in the middle and some trees and things. That could be another example of that additional drawing. But anyway, I just wanted to show you um, some other examples of what that additional drawing might look like.